How about we make some gorgeous earrings for the gamers out there? Okay, you guys, so we finally have a jewelry video. I know, no comment, no shade, it's been forever. Look, I still love these. Remember, this is a tutorial I used um, Asian newspaper from our local Asian supermarket to make earrings. I still love them. So I have these today. And then we are making something super cute. I'm just going to say it's a mystery earring. Stay tuned. Get your paint, your wooden pieces, your paint brushes, and let's do it up. Okay, finally a jewelry making video. <sighs> the crowd goes wild. No. Oh. <laughs> I'm talking to Miriam. Anyway, I digress. Let's go make some earrings. So here we go. I've already painted the bases. Um, I did flat black on the front and the back because I already know we're going to put a gloss coat on these. And then I put the blue lines. I realized when I did the light blue lines, they didn't really match the color of the video game I was patterning these after. But I went on and did um, the little odd shapes that you see where the little characters would go along to eat up stuff in the video game. And here you see me, I'm just adding the dots um, using a dotting tool. So if, if you're new to my videos, please subscribe, like the video, give it a thumbs up. But I got my dotting tools from Hobby Lobby and um, I'm just going along putting on the yellow dots that the little video game character would go through gobbling up to get points. So these are going to be so super cute. Wait until you see how they turned out. Totally love them. So here I am, I'm getting ready to use just a little tiny pointed brush and I'm gonna just be making shapes to make the video game characters. I'm not even using any rhyme or reason, I'm just making the upside down U and then kind of filling it in just so it resembles the look um, for the inspired game we're you know, making this after. So that's all I'm doing is I'm doing different um, colors, different upside down U patterns. I did a red, I did a purple, a pink, and like a teal green because I used the blue I should have actually used to make the character where we already had that blue line. So I didn't want it to really blend in. So that's all I'm doing here is adding the characters in.
how super cute they turned out. So now here, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go through putting the eyes on. So I'm taking that same paint brush and I'm just dotting on some white paint, putting on the black and giving it eyes. And so you don't even have to overthink it. You could use a smaller dotting tool to do this as well. You just wanna make sure like a couple times off camera, I put too much globs of paint, I had to go back and make some fixes. But that's what we're doing now is we're just adding the whites for the eyeballs and then we're just gonna do a simple little black dot to finish it up. I'm seriously screaming at the cuteness of these earrings. So here I am, I'm just using my smallest dotting tool to put the little black spots in the eyes and it brings them to life and gives them personality and makes them super cute, cuter than they already were. Okay, you guys, so I know this is the fastest jewelry making video I've probably ever done in my entire life. We're gonna look and see. Well, I'm about to drop y'all. <laughs> We're gonna look and see what they look like. Probably because I didn't show you every single step, step by step. I didn't talk as much. Oh my gosh. Are they not the cutest ever? Video game earrings. So super, super cute. Not sure if I'm gonna sell them or not. If you want a pair, let me know. I would probably retail them for 25 bucks. So if you want a pair, let me know. I can send you the PayPal link and then I'll make you a pair. God bless you guys. See you on the next video. I do have an idea. I think it's gonna be something cutesy wootsy. I'm gonna do my best to get it done today, but we'll see, okay? God bless you guys. It's Garlinda. Like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. You know you want to. Bye.